What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic kick butt day today so far. So, guys, we are counting down the precious hours before the arrival of the newest Mythic Brawler to the game, Gene. We just hit under that one day mark. Only 18 hours left before the release. And, guys, I gotta tell you, it's making me feel some type of way. This is the very first Brawler that we've had in Brawl Stars with a countdown. And I feel like as it's getting closer and closer, it's making me more and more anxious for this release. I'm a little bit worried that I don't have enough Brawl Boxes. I know I have a lot, but I feel like I've gotten gypped out of a lot of different brawlers or it took a long time to open up specific brawlers in the game so I'm really really nervous but I'm super super excited. Now there is a few things I want to cover about Gene before we get into today's video and that is a very frequently asked question that I get here on the channel and that is when is he going to be coming out in these shop offers? As you guys know it's the absolute best way to know specifically that you're going to be getting Gene. As you guys know in the beginning of the video I mentioned that I'm a little bit nervous that I might not get him with 461 brawl boxes so if you have quite a bit less than that say like 80 or under 100 you might have a hard time getting him. <laughs> So the way the updates have been working, whenever they release a new Brawlers, the very first day, there won't be any shop offers so that you can open up your Brawl Boxes to try to get Gene. However, on the very next day, the day after, there should be some Gene offers if we compare it to the last previous updates with Brawlers coming out like Leon. The very first day, there was nothing, and then the second day, there were some really, really good shop offers at discounted prices. Now, I know a lot of you guys are free to play, and the Gene will come in time. It just takes a little bit of time to acquire those Brawl Boxes while you're playing free to play, but the only reason I'm bringing this up is that I don't want you guys, if you're deciding to spend a little bit of money in the game, to do it on the very first day and open up Brawl Boxes with those gems that you're putting on your account. If you want Gene specifically, wait for the second day. It's going to be hard. There's going to be a lot of content coming out on YouTube. Um, a lot of people playing with Gene getting on the very first day, but it's going to be in your best interest to wait for the following day when those shop offers actually come around the corner. Please do not spend gems on the first day if you don't necessarily spend a whole lot in Brawl Stars and you only want that Gene. Please do that for me. <laughs> so yeah guys, the hype around Gene is absolutely insane. It's so much fun when they release new Brawlers into the game. It gets the whole entire Brawl Stars community talking about one specific thing and I absolutely love that. And you guys better believe once that 18 hours is up and that Gene is released, I'm going to be getting that sucker. So make sure to tune into tomorrow's video and watch me pull that Gene out of the Brawl Boxes. And to make sure you don't miss that, make sure to subscribe down below and be a part of the Ray Fam. There's going to be a lot of fun videos coming with Gene around the corner. I'm super, super psyched. Hopefully you guys are excited as well for the newest Brawler coming to the game. Now guys, that is not the only thing that we're going to be doing in today's video. As you guys know, it is February 14th, the day of love, Valentine's Day. Now your boy Ray is single, so he doesn't necessarily celebrate Valentine's Day, but it's a really good holiday. I feel like a lot of people are in pretty dang good moods. There's a lot of candy involved, a lot of chocolate, and you know what? That is never a bad thing. But more importantly, to celebrate the holidays, you guys know I announced a giveaway of the newest skin in the game, Serenade Poco. So we're going to be getting into those giveaway winners right now. Here we go. Alrighty guys, so we're going to be picking three different winners today for the Serenade Poco skin. So make sure if your name is called, comment down below. I'm going to be active in my comments basically the entire day. So I'm going to get in contact with you either through Discord or Twitter and find out some of your details. Um, but yeah guys, let's get straight away into it. Here we go. Winner number one is... Let's see, let's see, let's see, and hopefully I don't butcher your name. One thing I'm worried about are all these. Dragon Slayer Brawl Stars. I don't have a girlfriend. Neither do I, my friend. My date today for Valentine's Day is more than likely Brawl Stars. <laughs> Winner number two is... Let's see. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? And you know what? You can put this money towards Gene if you wanted to as well. Mason Sy... Sagnet? Signet? <laughs> I love you, Vince. Thank you. I butchered your last name. I'm so, so sorry. But Mason, I have a really good friend's name is Mason. But yeah, congratulations, my man. Let's get into winner number three, the final winner. Here we go. And the final winner. Drum roll, please. Let's see who's it going to be. The final one. The final one. Who's going to win the skin? It is Austin. Okay, please. I've never won a giveaway. Well, you won today, my man. That's what I'm talking about, guys. And I know. 10% battery. I'm going to get a lot of comments in, in the comments down below on that, I know. But congratulations to all the giveaway winners. Thank you so, so much for the love and support on the channel. But if you didn't win this time, don't worry. There's going to be plenty more around the corner. So guys, with the remainder of the video, we're going to be hopping in some high-level gameplay with an actual organized team comp, probably on Gem Grab or Brawl Ball. So hope you guys are pumped up for that. Let's get into it. Here we go. Alrighty guys, so I got a few of my buddies in Brawl Stars. We're going to be hopping in some games. First things first, I'm Brawl Ball. And as you can see, I'm bringing in Tar. One to kind of fit the mold of the Gene. 
mean, as you guys know, I feel like they kind of fit this family thing that you see kind of going around in Brawl Stars where like Frank and Mortis fit in one or like uh, Daryl and uh, Penny fit in one kind of category. Um, so I think Tara and Jean are like those family members. So we're going to do like that and then we're going to be hopping into other girl brawlers because it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> okay, let's hop into the very first one. Here we go. Okay, guys, hopping into the very first game. And if you guys didn't notice by the actual loading screen, the Lunar New Year get up is gone. Um, it happened today, so we'll have to see here. They have a Mortis, which our ball scorer, and or, uh, Daryl, is much better than Mortis. But we'll see what we can do here. Pool Party is turning into one of my favorite Brawl Ball maps for some reason. I know a lot of people kind of complain about the water on this map, but I don't think it's that big a deal. I kind of like it. Nice. And nose. Let's go. Okay. Nicely done. Okay. We got Daryl down. Daryl down. Okay, right now I'm just playing as passive as possible, trying to get my super so we can make a break for it. See if we can't get a double, a double super or a triple. Okay, double? Okay, just one. That's okay. Nice, let's get the bull off of him. Okay, we have half super. It's basically Tars is a waiting game, a super game. <laughs> you just want to try to get the super. It was a bad first super on our part though, but we're slowly pushing in. Good, good, good. I'm going to go like this. Break the wall. Nice. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Nice. We should be able to just walk it in. Yep. Yes, sir. Let's go. Okay. So we're out by one. So we can play defense or we can just keep going offense. And I'm telling you guys, you need to run Daryl at Brawl Ball. <laughs> I think that's what's giving us the edge. And Jesse's really good on this map as well. Okay. We're going down. Block. Block for him. Okay. What? What? We're making it close. But I think I have my super now. So we can do some work with that. Oh, one more shot. Okay, nice. Okay. Nice. Okay, we gotta push. We gotta push. Push, push, push. Push, push, push. Takes a while to respawn. Just walk it in. Walk it in. Walk it in. Yes! That's what I'm talking about, guys. Tara OP. I just say Daryl OP. That's the reason why we won. Hey, we got Star Player 2. Let's go. Okay, let's hop into another game here. Let's go. Alrighty guys, so the next brother that we're taking into the game is Sakura Spike. I think it's a girl. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. Uh, would be a girl that'd be taken on a Valentine's date though. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Alrighty guys, hopping straight away into it. And as you guys are seeing, the brawlers that I like to play are those kind of medium range brawlers. And specifically like Daryl and Mortis as of recently. I really like playing with them. But I feel really, really solid with a Spike. Sometimes Tara, depends on the map. But Spike for sure. And Nita, <laughs> those mid, like those medium range brawlers. Let's just keep going like this. Try to keep poking, poke, poke, poke. Then let's get our super down. Heal. Okay, we almost took them out. Let's go. Our Daryl hard counters the Frank, but the Shelly hard counters our Daryl. So we're gonna have to really, really help out against the Shelly because we have really good range against her. There we go. All right, let's see what we can do here. Okay, we got our super. Just take out this Leon. Get him out of here. Auto aim. Okay. Nice super. Nice go. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Also, you guys, there's something that I learned not too long ago while I was practicing, practicing for the ESL. If you're a ball scorer, I'm sure a lot of people know about this already. But if you don't, it can be really, really useful in Brawl Ball. And that is you can shoot the ball if you're right on top of someone. You see that circle around the character? If you're on top of that circle, you can shoot the ball through them. Um, I'll try and demonstrate. Or you just saw Enoch did it in that last goal. You can be literally on top of someone and they won't stop the ball if they're in that little ring around your character. Right, let's go like this. Nice. Nice. Take a people out. That's why you see, like, <laughs> back in the day, the Mortis ball scores were absolutely insane. Because all they'd have to do is just motor up, get on top of someone, and just score the ball. Okay. Let's see? See if we can't demonstrate. Heal, heal, heal. Okay, never mind. All right, let's see. See? Oh, never mind. I was trying to do it, but he was still in his goal. It wouldn't have mattered. But guys, we're killing it. Let's go. Back-to-back -back wins. Okay, let's switch to gem grab here. All right, guys, so we're hopping into gem grab. And the next girl that we're taking in is Pam. Would you take Pam on a date? Would you? Would you? Okay, hopping into it. Here we go. <laughs> okay, hopping straight away into it. Let's see, let's see, let's see. We have a Rico. A Shelly and a Jesse we're going up against. They don't have a solidified gem carrier. I guess the Jesse is. We'll see if she plays actually. Okay. Perfect. The Daryl can win against 
a Shelly if he supers right. Okay, let's just damage her a little bit. Enoch is basically waiting for his super. You want to play Daryl like Assassination. Okay, we're trying to evade shots as well as help out in other lanes. Keeping Jesse low. We don't want her to get her turret. Let's go like this. Help out Enoch. Okay. Okay, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. I would honestly say I think I think Pam is the best gem carry on this map. So I'd be rocking her. Okay. I'm just going to take out this turret. Nice. She's not max, so she can't get benefit from shooting the turret. Okay, so we lost our side on the right. That should be fine. Are we going to lose our side on the left as well? Okay, we have... We can play it safe. We can play it safe. I'm going to get this gem as well. We need one more gem. There we go. So we got the countdown. Let's go. Solid control, guys. Kind of lost a little bit at the end. Our lanes, but our teammates really, really did a good job with the control. Oh, and Ocha's going to get blasted by the super, but not straight up. Okay, drop down our super. Try to take refuge behind it. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's go, guys. We're three for three. <laughs> Let's go. We're doing really, really well. And now, guys, for the final game. We're playing Piper as the mid. I think this should be really, really shaky. But we'll see how we can do. But Piper's one of those staple girls in the game. You would definitely take Piper out on a date. Okay, guys. Redemption. Game number two. Ooh, baby. Okay, we're going up. In I'm not sure if these guys are good. I feel like I've seen that um, uh, Leon before, I think. I'm not sure. Okay, they don't have a mid, though. Which kind of makes me feel that they don't. Unless they're running just straight aggro team comps here. Not good at shooting from the side. Nice. Okay, we hit him. Deal. We really need to make sure that we are looking for Leon and his star power if he's in his super. Yikes! Okay, back off, Ray! Oh, baby! 89 HP. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> okay. One thing that you got to kind of get down with Piper if you're playing her as a mid is don't necessarily worry about picking up gems. You can just control, kill, and then pick up, like, a group of them, you know? Okay, I, I don't want to use my super. I was I was debating using my super on the bear. But I'd rather save it for once uh, the Leon gets his super. Nice, taking out the Leon. Okay. Dang it. Haha, <laughs> got him. Okay, let's go. The bear is going to be tricky for us. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Let's go. Take out the bear. That's one thing that we need to do is prioritize the bear. Okay, she doesn't have her... Okay, let's wait. Oh, they're pressuring us so well. We just need to land some shots. Nicely done. Land some shots, Ray. Come on. Do your thing. Ah, we're going down, but I can super up there. Good job, Anoch! Good job, good job, good job. Okay, come on. Let's go. Super up, super up, super up, super up, super up. Good deal. We're missing, we're missing. Missing, 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 but I think we're going to get the gems first. But we have to be careful for a Leon. Where's the Leon? Okay, we have countdown, but... Okay, get the, get the Nita, get the Nita. Yes, we got the Nita! Okay, we got countdown. Okay, we still have to play. We still have to play. No! Come on! Yes, okay. Take him down. Oh my goodness. We're going to end it on that note. <laughs> I don't think Piper is a very good mid. But we tried, right? We tried. And you guys have been saying, put more losses in. So I'll do just that. We got, what, two for two? Two for four? That's what it was in the end? We should have been able to beat that team. I'm just a crappy piper on gem grab. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. So, hope you all enjoyed today's video. Good luck with getting Gene tomorrow. It should be a really, really fun video tomorrow as well. Hopefully, I can get him with the brawl boxes that I have. But if I need to spend a little bit of money in order to get him after our brawl boxes, which 400 should be enough, 
um, I'll more than likely do that. So guys, hopefully you did enjoy it. If you did, make sure to leave a like on it. I really appreciate that. Also, consider hitting the subscribe button down below, being a part of the Ray fam. I would also really, really appreciate that. So guys, with that being said, make sure to keep having fun with Brawl Stars, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace out.